Masks are mandatory in New York State beginning Friday. That's if you cannot practice social distancing. Signs calling for that sacred space are a regular sight at many businesses and stores. Get ready to see this one about wearing face coverings. Baxter has worn one since the beginning. It's good because the faster we uh, deal with the uh, situation, the better. New York Governor Andrew Cuomo issued the executive order Wednesday afternoon. People must have a mask or mouth nose covering when social distancing is not possible. A bandana or scarf will do. It definitely applies to transit and busy streets, any place we cannot maintain that six feet. So why now? Governor Cuomo says it's necessary to do this to keep down the spread and especially as things start to reopen in the future. Don't infect me. You don't have a right to infect me. These are the signs that have appeared around New Jersey as shoppers are required to wear them, if not there to be refused service. New Jersey's governor ordered that last week. Mayor de Blasio says face coverings are required in grocery stores in New York City now. You know, going to a diner or something like that, you see a sign, you know, no, no shirt, no shoes, no service. It's the same exact concept. He says NYPD will help enforce it and spread the message. The governor says there could be civil penalties for not complying with the state requirement to wear something when you can't do social distancing. And by the way, people will enforce it. They'll say to you, if they're standing next to you on a street corner, where's your mask, buddy? In a nice New York kind of way. It is something that people uh, certainly have adopted on their own. Uh, I think that probably that six foot check uh, will probably be a, a new part of it. The governor says there could be penalties and he'll, he'll, he'll look at this if he hears people aren't complying. On the Upper East Side, Greg Mocker, PIX11 News.